yes so hi guys yes it's Nemo Ras once again with a very interesting video I know you are you are wondering what's this so being World Cup season I decided to come and explain some of the things that people don't understand yeah cause you know to know now like there are some people saying that some of the Qatar stadiums are shaped or designed like uh sema like they are designed like a private part of a woman which is not the truth so today uh, today in this video i'm going to explain to you some of the designs yeah the designs of some of the stadiums that are being used for a world cup and uh, as you can see uh Qatar has built uh, they ha they have built seven uh seven new stadiums just to host the World Cup. So I'm going to start with the uh, stadium that uh, stadium that opened World Cup, like where Qatar played their World Cup the first day. Yes, and it is called Al Bayat. Yes, Al Bayat Stadium. Yes, Al Bayat Stadium is located in the northern city of Al Khor. Yes, Al Khor. What were Al Khor? Kowapi. And in the and this is where the World Cup opened. Yeah was held yeah the world cup opening was held yeah so it holds a capacity of 60,000 people yes it holds a, a capacity of 60,000 people and the most important thing is the shape yeah the shape now as you can see it has a shape this shape uh it has its own meaning yes obviously because they can't just build a, a stadium without having something behind it but i want to tell you some a little history about al bayat al bayat was opened was officially opened in 30th november 2021 yes 30th november 2021 and the groundbreaking was done uh, was done in 2014 so you can see the duration that it took for which to be built so let's go to the next <laughs> let's go to the next point um, about the shape yeah so al bayat is shaped like a tent yeah al bayat is shaped like a tent known as bayat al shar yes bayat al shar tent historically used by nomadic people in the Qatar and gulf region so this stadium is built like a tent the shape the shape represent a tent is as you can just you can just look closely and see it look like a tent so it is it's symbolic being is a tent that that was used armor that is used by the nomadic yeah by the nomadic people of qatar and gulf region and it's like uh yeah it's like a tent and by the way there is something uh they, they 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 are also saying that after the world cup you see it's like a tent a nomadic a nom it, 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 it's used by nomadic people so after qatar i mean after the world cup they are going to give away the seat the the stadium seat just like a tent i'm a, just like a nomadic things that it, it will keep on moving and moving so after his in after his seat they are going to give away to the developing countries that need stadium seats so it's going to be nomadic like in Ainda to from one place to another so it's not going to be a permanent it's not going to be a permanent stadium so that's some of the history about uh al bayat yes and this is where the world cup started yani this is where the first match of world cup between Qatar and ecuador uh was held so guys let's continue watching for the rest of the stadium so that you are going to understand more about Qatar stadiums that were built just some of them by day they were built uh, in 2020 21 2021 yes you're going to learn about so you can just see it just look like a tent and that's it so guys thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe and to all the new subscribers feel welcome again and again and again yes let's continue watching the world cup and please tell us which team are you representing yes for me uh, i don't know let me not say right now but anyways if you haven't subscribed make sure you're subscribed so that you are going to learn more about the rest of the stadiums thank you